Jesus' words, do not be afraid, resonate in the letter that Cardinal Sandri, Prefect of the Congregation of Eastern Churches, sent to bishops around the world on the occasion of this year's collection for the Holy Land. Every day, Christians in various regions of the Middle East are questioning whether to stay or emigrate. They live in insecurity or suffer violence, sometimes simply because they profess their faith, which is our own faith. This is what Sandri wrote in his letter. His, do not be afraid, is therefore addressed to them, our parents in the faith. This is why the Universal Church has not failed to reach the needy through fundraising, through the contribution of dioceses from around the world to the Mother Church of Jerusalem. On Good Friday, we would like to bring Jerusalem's cry for peace to the foot of the cross, so that the world starting with Jesus' land can become a city of peace. Christians of the Holy Land rely heavily on the help that comes to them through this special moment of the year. The collection is therefore regulated by specific pontifical provisions that allocate funds primarily to the Franciscan custody responsible for the maintenance of the different shrines at the holy places and to the pastoral, educational, welfare, healthcare and social structures that help improve the life of the parishes and of the various ecclesial bodies so that as active and lively communities they can continue to be guardians of the gospel. The money raised will go to the completion of urgent restorations, such as the renovation of the roof of the Basilica of the Nativity in Bethlehem, and over several years it will go to support projects that provide housing to young families so that they can remain in the Holy Land. But that is not all. The collection will go toward implementing a comprehensive school network, especially through the parishes, fostering the expansion of high-quality education that is already well appreciated on an ecumenical and interreligious level. Special attention will be given to possible emergencies and in 2013, as in past years, the priority is Syria, stricken by a war that has sadly recently celebrated the third anniversary of its violent eruption. Through the Good Friday collection, the Catholic communities of the Holy Land will be supported in helping the poor and suffering without any distinction of creed or ethnicity. The parishes will keep their doors open to every need, as also the schools, where Christians and Muslims are preparing for a future of respect and collaboration. Hospitals and clinics, hospices and community centres will continue to offer their assistance. So starting now, concluded Cardinal Sandri, we will accompany Pope Francis, who is preparing a pilgrimage of unity and peace to the Holy Land, a long-awaited visit, much desired and necessary visit. It will confirm the faith of Christians and make them ever more capable of mercy, forgiveness and love. The Middle East is in desperate need of this.